long is it going to take you to set ordinary breakfast? How long? Sorry, Ma, it's almost ready. It's almost ready. Be fast about it. Okay. If my son leaves this house without taking his breakfast, consider yourself fired. You're ready now, You better be. You met your dad. You just, you just remind me about your dad. Everything about you is your dad, honestly. Oh, God knows best. I. Oh yeah. Oh, who's ready? So now she brought the toothache to me. Can you imagine? Sonia. Why am I being served with a dirty plate? Uh, sir, I, I washed it. Are you listening to yourself? So I'm talking nonsense, right? You washed it and yet the plate is dirty. Sonia, I thought I made myself clear on how you serve in this house. Yes, you did, Mom, but I washed this plate. It's okay, I, I'll just No, 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 wash no, no, it no, 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 don't worry, don't worry. Don't worry. Let, let it be. Let it be. Come closer there. All right, get me that bread. Go back and serve him properly. Oh, there's no need. I've lost my appetite. Stupid girl. I've lost Son. I've lost, I'm not eating again, I'm tired. Nonsense. Will you come and clear this place now? You see what you've cost? Clear up this place and clean it up! <laughs> Nonsense. Manage, okay? There's really nothing I can do now. But I need the fee. I know. It's barely a week I started working here. I haven't been paid salary yet. yet. They are going to charge me yet. for literacy show. I know, don't worry. I could do something about it. Yet. My yet. food has also finished and yet. I don't have money to buy my handout. Yet. And I, my exam yet. is around the corner. Yet. I don't even know I'm going to go. Yet. Let's just focus on your books and study, okay? Right. Right. What is the point if I can't write my exams? Just focus on your books and leave the money part for me, okay? Don't worry. Okay, thank right. you, sister. Thank you. I'll take care. <sighs> oh, God. Honestly, Daniel, I... I do not blame Mr. Riggs for not taking the business. Oh, well, I, I totally agree with you, yeah. It's a normal thing, actually. I know you like this wine. <laughs> you like it, right? <laughs> of course I do. Yeah, thank you. Hmm. Oh, thank you, dear. Uh, anything else? Get my dinner ready. Daniel. Wait, wait. A new housekeeper? Oh, yeah. We needed to change the other one. Daniel, tell me, where exactly do you get them from. I mean, you change them like boxes. <laughs> Come on, don't stop, buddy. Well, I have a job agent that brings them to me anytime I want them. 
Mm. But you see this one, I don't think she's going anytime soon. Yeah, yeah. Because... <laughs> I'm getting choked on your wife. Mm. So I thought about this and I... You look so amazing! Thank you, Mama. <laughs> Welcome, darling. Thank you, Mama. This house has been so boring without you. Mama, don't worry. I'm here now. I don't have any other travel plans. Sure. Yes. <laughs> I missed you, darling. I missed you. I missed you. Too. Welcome back. Thank you. Yeah. Thank you. Welcome. <laughs> Another one, as always. Why does he like employing pigs? <sighs> hey, turn around, turn, turn, turn. Turn around, let me see. Turn. Oh, God. <sighs> Daniel. <sighs> he doesn't have eyes while Picking these things. Ah, pig, come take my suitcase to the. Oh, no. Be careful. Be careful with that. Because if you scratch it, you'll pay. Because I know that your, <laughs> I know your entire generation cannot afford it. Diva, hmm. why are you stressing yourself over this thing? Huh? You just want to ruin your day. You know you're just coming back. Eh? No. My darling, I missed you so much. I <laughs> miss you more. <laughs> I missed you. Come, we have a lot to catch up. For real? Wait, wait, wait. Yes, hold on, hold on. Okay, hold on. <laughs> For real? I, I missed you. God, I can't wait for the cheese. Hey, darling. I missed you so much. Same here, baby. Mm. Mm hmm. You daddy want to come and see me. You abandoned me here like that. Making me crave for you so much. <laughs> I love the word crave, baby. Mm. Mm -hmm. I could say the same. I missed you a lot. Come on, darling. That's not true. That's <laughs> not true. And you didn't come to see me? Yeah, that's because I wanted to know how much you missed me. Okay. Stop messing with my head. Stop it. I'm not. That's what you're doing. You see, you're not. <laughs> <laughs> come on. Hey, come here. Um, I love you so much. I love you too. Um, babe. Yeah. That reminds me. You knew her. Mm, okay, what about her? I don't like her. Honey, you just got here today and you're not liking her already. That's so fast. She's dirty and insensitive. All that. I guess she's not used to this environment. But don't worry, darling. Give her time, she'll pick, okay? Besides, she knows how to cook, and that's what we need her for. Hmm? Babe, I want her gone. <sighs> Diva, baby. Come on, you just got here today. Why don't you just rest for tonight? Besides, forget about it. The young lady's not going anywhere. I said I want Stop her it. gone. Stop it! I'm not in for this drama, please. It's too early. <clears throat> I like your nails, they're beautiful. I know, right? Thank you. Yeah. yeah oh, I'll put this here. Oh. Excuse me. That's fine. Oh, yeah, let me have that. Bread not crunchy. Uh, sorry, Ma. I, you didn't toast it. I thought you would like it like this, fresh. Well, I like it like this. Is it so difficult for you to do your job? You have few responsibilities in this house. One is to cook, and yet you're so dumb at it. 
Come on, babe. There's nothing wrong with the food. Oh, why would there be? After all, you're the one that employed a pig and you've refused to fire her. I'm sorry, Ma. I'll shh, just get you. Shut up. Shut up. Do not talk when I'm talking. Sorry, Ma. Idiot. How long have you been working in this house? A week and counting. A week and counting. And your dumb head could not tell you that everyone has a preference in this house. Eh? How did you even get employed? Babe, don't you think you're overreacting? Oh, am I? Yes, you are. I am overreacting. If I don't get another in the next five minutes, then you will know what overreacting is. Come on, take this thing off my face. Idiot. Daddy P, just get out. Everything, you, you'll be sluggish with everything. Ordinary food again that they, they paid you to cook. You can't even do it. You don't have common sense. But you know, that was totally out of place. This is exactly how you like your bread. So why still do it different? You're supporting her? That's not the point. The point is I want you to let her walk peacefully. So, I want these properly washed. If you don't wash them well, get ready to rewash them. Okay. Are they? And that thing, be careful. Because one of it can buy you. And I don't want to hear that anyone is missing. Because you will pay with your life. What are you trying to do? I want to put this in the washing machine. You want to put my clothes in the washing machine? Wait, do you think your entire generation can afford my clothes? You think your poverty stricken self can afford my clothes? Do you have washing machine in your father's house? Eh? In your father's house, I know you used your bare hands to wash your clothes. You're in this house now, you want to start forming posh as a doll baby that you are. You don't have hands to wash clothes again. Madam, if I'm talking to you, look at me. You want to spoil my clothes? Are you stupid? Are you sure you have you have sense? Do you? Do you have sense? Eh? Pig. Sorry. sorry for yourself. Don't be sorry yet. Just wait until you spoil my clothes. Then you'll not have the mouth to say sorry. Idiot. Come on, use your hands to, to wash those clothes. Animal. Hurry up, because you have other things to do. I'm giving you only five minutes. Wash it fast and come back into the house and do other things. Lazy ass woman being. Nonsense. Animal. I hate her. I hate her so much. She's just evil and wicked. Just calm down. Calm down. And I thought his mother was my problem. But that one, she's certainly my worst nightmare. You speak of her with so much hatred. You don't even get it, do you? You don't get the picture I'm trying to paint of her, do you? Maybe she's just jealous of you. Jealous? Why? What, what do I have that anyone can be jealous of? She just doesn't like me and it's obvious. Okay, okay. Calm down. Hmm? 
wipe your tears. We'll think of something to do. Okay, how about you find another job? Now, I signed a six month contract. No wonder he was insisting I sign it before I get the job because he knows he has demons in his house. Wow. <sighs> Well, since there's nothing we can do, that means you just have to, you know, calm down and tolerate things. Who knows? Maybe she will change. Change? That lady can never change. Wickedness is in her DNA. Hmm. Well, just ignore her. And, you know, before you know it, the six months will elapse and you can move on with your life. I've only worked here for a week. I have five months and three weeks, and that seemed like forever. I'm really trying to imagine the kind of person that she is. Don't dream me around like I'm a toy just because I'm a maid. Well, since this is how it is now, you just have to ignore and focus on getting your money so that you can get a better life for yourself. I'm sure if you make it, she's not going to see you to come and start talking down at you. So just focus on getting your money, okay? I'm so sorry. It's okay. Calm down, yeah? Stop crying now. Stop crying. You don't have to thank me, okay? Don't worry, it, it's okay. I have two sister. I was almost losing my mind. Ha, ha, getting the money was not even possible. I have to thank you now. It's fine, just manage the money, okay? You know I haven't been paid salary. Don't worry, everything will be okay. Even the money I gave you was Vivian that loaned it to me. Ah, thank you, Steve, for taking care of us. I thank you very much, my sister. Thank you. Stop thanking me. Don't worry, just. Just face your studies, okay, and come out with, you know, flying colors. So I won't have to regret it. You won't, I promise. You won't regret it. <laughs> I believe in you. Don't worry. Once they pay me a salary, I'll complete the rest, okay? All right. Stay safe. Pig. What money are you talking about? Oh, that's the money I gave my brother. Oh. You now steal from us? No, uh, no, I, I, I didn't steal from anyone. I, I'm not a thief. Uh, actually, I, I got the money from my friend. She loaned it to me. My friend Vivian. You see you. Hmm? God help you. If I find anything funny. Feels the same. Daniel, Daniel, you have not been taking care of yourself. Your blood pressure is very high this morning. And you're not doing anything about it. But I'm doing my best. What would you have me do, Sam? Your best is not good enough. Okay. You have to be serious with it. You have to stick to the rules. If not, I don't have any other choice than to give you a bed in this hospital. And I know you wouldn't like that. Give you a bed? Come on now, kiddo. What are you saying? Wait, do you think I enjoy coming to this hospital to look at your face? Come off it. Daniel, you have to be intentional about your health. You have to. I said I have heard you. Okay? Besides, why are you making it look like it's a big deal? Are you trying to scare me? Daniel, you have to be careful. You have to be careful. 
Sam, I have heard you. Come on. Can I leave now? I don't like the smell of hospitals. <laughs> we can't be serious. I'm serious. <laughs> See you, Roger. Don't worry. Where's the food? I'm hungry. Hey. Oh, finally, it's ready. It is ready. Mm hmm. Mm, this looks good and it smells delicious. It sure is. Right. <laughs> Let's see. <laughs> what's this? What? What do you mean, what's this? It's too salty. I can't take it, please. How? How, how is this salty? Ah. Oh. oh. Sonia! Sonia! Please make dinner for me to eat. Wait, but I just made you dinner. Oh, it's so salty, I can't eat it. What do you mean it's too salty? Salt is good for your health. Why? Okay, maybe you should have just said something. Instead of embarrassing me like that. You made it look like she cooks better than me. Is that nice? Oh, no, relax, okay? Let's listen. listen. Ah! It's, Whatever. it's not what you think. Oh. It's too salty. It's not good for my health. That's why. So I can have it. So now, please be fast. How much do you think she can be trusted? What are you even saying? Why would you allow such thoughts come into your head in the first place? Daniel, I just want you to be safe, okay? Okay, fine. I appreciate you looking out for me. But at the same time, I want you to stop having nonsense thoughts in your head. She can be anything but not a cheat. Please. Don't get me wrong, okay? She might not be cheating on you, but she's definitely bad business. All right? My instincts don't lie to me. Oh, there's a first time to everything. Not me. Bro, I don't, I don't trust this girl. <sighs> Look, Jonathan, I know you don't like her. You don't like her one bit, but I need you to respect the fact that I love her so much and back off. Understood. All right. Good. Say I didn't want you. Thank you. So what were you saying about the new contract, the new client? What is this saying? Oh, um... I want it as private as possible. Mm. Hell no. I want it elaborate. So, so elaborate. <laughs> yeah. All mothers do, I guess. That's my only son you're talking about. Though. And there'll be no plan for me to plan any wedding again. Mom, even if it's not your only son or child, yeah, I know you still want to invite everyone. Yeah, I understand. Mothers do not joke with their children's wedding. Just like my mom, I mean, she's already compiling the list of guests for my wedding. <laughs> I mean, that's the joy of it. I know, right? And a thing of pride too. Mm -hmm. Mothers nice. always want to show the world that their children are doing well. My dear, all I just want to do is to celebrate. That's all I want to celebrate. Yeah, I know. <laughs> oh. Hi, mom. Hi, son. Yeah, you good? Yeah. Hey, baby. Mm -hmm. Back. What's the meaning of that? Maybe bad day. I don't know. He's always looking for a way to make me look stupid. Relax. Daniel loves you. You know it. Maybe he's tired or something. Ooh. 
Sonia? Uh, sir. Why are you all by this time? I thought you're done with your work. Yes, I'm, I'm done with the work, but... But what? <sighs> Madame Diva said I should stay up. You should stay up to do what exactly? She said I shouldn't go to bed unless it's 12 midnight, just in case she needs anything. Oh, madness. What's what is wrong? You can go to bed. Hmm? I said go to bed. Thank you, sir. Yeah. Do you need anything, sir? No, I'm fine. I'm just asking because it's late and you're up. You know you still have to go to work tomorrow. Yeah, I'm just up for a few minutes. I want to get water. Go to bed. All right, sir. Good night, sir. I'll be leaving for London tomorrow. I'm coming with you. Hell no. Who is going to take care of my son? Well, it appears he doesn't need me. He does. Just men and their pride. It doesn't seem like that to me. I'll be staying for a while. Mom, I thought you stopped all this advocacy thing. I've been doing this all my life, and you know that's what I know how to do best. I know, Mom, but you're getting old and you need to rest. Besides, I thought you trained a lot of people to take over from you. Am I? Mm -hmm. Or you just want me to keep staying in this house with you? Well, both. I knew my presence isn't needed. You just have to stop treating this lady this way. Mom, how am I treating her? I'm treating her nicely, of course. No, you are not. <laughs> Mom, listen. She's just looking for someone to put in her pocket. And I'm not that kind of man. I'm not. Every marriage works when the man is intentional about the woman. It's a pity your father passed away when you were too tender. You just have to trade with caution. Okay, Let's come talk about something else. Yeah, so when are you coming back? I'm so interested in that. Hey, 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 pig! Where are you going? Um I'm going to my friend's house, ma. You don't have work to do? Oh, um, I'm done with all my morning chores. Besides, today is my day off. I'm not supposed to work today. Meaning? Today is your day off. You're not supposed to work today. But then will you get inside and prepare lunch? Ma, but my, my contract says I, I, I'm entitled to one day off every week. Oh, you're entitled to one day off every week? Madam, come on, will you go inside and prepare lunch? You, you, you want to go to your friend's house? Idiot. You think I give you a damn about your, your, your contract? Look, if you leave this house, don't just bother coming back. My mood will not be spoiled in Jesus' name. Nurse, Sir. you have to come and uh, check him up. Maybe in the, in the next 30 minutes. Okay. Okay. I know. Oh. What is wrong with these people? Can't they get this hospital properly cleaned? God, this hospital stinks for goodness sake. It's not that bad. Shut up. 
record. I don't know why Daniel chose this time to be sick. Of all time. Oh God, I, God, this place stinks, man. Nobody wishes to be sick, it just happens. Who gave you the audacity to talk back? Did I ask for your opinion? Sorry, ma'am. Low life bitch. Pig. Um, let me know when he wakes up. I'm going home to rest. I can't stand the smell of this place. It stinks. Ah, God. I see if our attitude doesn't stink as well. Yeah, you're this way. Good morning, sir. How are you feeling, sir? I'm feeling better. Where's, where's, where's Diva? Uh, she... She stepped out. Do you need anything? No, I'm fine. Oh, baby. Good morning. Baby. <sighs> How are you feeling? I thought I asked you to call me. He just woke up. Go and call the doctor. Baby? Are you okay? I brought you food, baby. You need to eat. Of him, you dirty pig. <sighs> oh, don't worry, I'll be fine. So, do you need help? I can. Are, are you deaf? Are you? Will you go back to your cleaning and learn to mind your business? But he, but he clearly needs help, and you're not weak. Shut up! Is something wrong with you? Get out! That's fine, so never mind. You can go. Are you, are, are you daft? Or are you trying my patience or what? Baby. You'll be fine, okay? You know you just have to do this yourself so you get stronger. Hmm? Yeah. Okay. You'll be fine, okay? Um, I can't say it's been easy, but I'm trying my best. I know you are. Whoop is responding to treatment. Yes, he is. Um, I try as much as possible to give him his medications. But, I don't know, sometimes it makes it a bit difficult for me. I understand, my dear. But you know, it's just difficult for him to adopt. Just give him time, it will come around, trust me. Well, 
I mean, if I don't take care of him, who will? <laughs> Thank you, dear. I am almost done here. I will soon be home to assist. Oh, no, 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 no. Mama, no, just take your time, okay? Take your time. Don't be in a rush. Rest well, have fun. I'm here taking care of him, okay? Don't, you know, come back hurriedly. He's fine with me. <laughs> Aren't I so lucky to have you? I'm more lucky. <laughs> okay, Mama. Um, talk to you later, okay? Bye. Heaven knows that I'm tired of this nonsense play. Sometimes I just feel like killing her. Uh -uh. So yeah, that's too much now. No? It's not. That lady is a demon. Imagine she stood there and watched him fall. Uh -uh. How did he even get himself involved with such a witch? Carrying such wickedness. Is it not heavy? Uh -uh. Calm down. Just calm down. Speaking rubbish. Telling me nonsense. She had the gut to speak to me like that after I covered up for her at the hospital. Such an ungrateful feeling. Sonia, I've told you. It's obvious she's trouble. So just let her be. She's just hell-bent on making my life and my job miserable. Like I told you, and I'll keep telling you, she's trouble. So... Stay away from her and focus on your work. It's not her fault. My father were to be alive. She won't see me, let alone talk to me, however. Sonia, the fact still remains that you need this job. And most importantly, you need the patience to keep the job. Stupid. She's a room. I think I'm hungry. It's too quick. I'm talking about that witch. If you're hungry. Go to the kitchen. Huh? It's funny that like she's still she is. Calm down, Joe. Uh -uh. Just be complaining up and down. <laughs> Can I order something for us to eat? I don't want others. I want homemade food. You obviously don't like my food. So what do you want me to do? Where is Sonia? You made her entitled to a day off. So she's off. It's fine. Look, Sonia, I'm so sorry I had to call you back. I needed to... Okay. I'm happy to help. I appreciate it. It's okay. <laughs> Hmm. This is delicious. I like it. Thank you. Oh, you're really good at this cooking thing. Really good. <laughs> Thank you. My mom taught me. You know, as a firstborn child, she handed over the kitchen to me at an early age. Oh, God bless her. God bless your mom. Amen. And of course, God bless all the amazing mothers out there who we'll make our time to train their little ones to a girl child precisely. How to cook from early age. <laughs> and it's okay, sir. And now I'm enjoying the benefits. <laughs> if I need more, I'm in the kitchen. Oh, that's fine. Um, why don't you go home since it's your day off? It's fine. I'll stay. Hey, thank you. I appreciate it. Enjoy. Yeah. Mm. This is really good. Stop, stop. I'm not in for this. Please stop it. Babe, but I need you. It's almost a month now. You barely look at me. You barely touch me. You don't even act like there's a woman in this house. Come on. How else do you want me to explain to you that I'm not so strong for this? I'm not. I'm not feeling fine, you know it. 
Please, I have a whole lot on the table, and this is the list of it, please. Ben, are you trying to say that you don't find me attractive anymore? Oh, come on. That is not what I'm talking about. I'm just trying to let you know that I am so strong for this. I'm so strong I cannot do this. And I need you to understand, I beg you, please. There's nothing to understand. Oh, God. <laughs> okay, fine. Can I at least get some money? Stop being insensitive now, please. Because I asked for money? Really? Have you ever asked me how the business is doing now that I'm not feeling so fine? Have you ever asked? Obviously, you don't care. Please, I don't have money. And don't disturb me again. Good night. Interesting. So you now eat with meat in this house. Am I not supposed to? I'm entitled to eat anything I cook. It's part of my contract. Ah! The next time you talk back at me, you have yourself to be blamed. Sorry, ma. No wonder everything keeps finishing in this house. When was the last time you cooked with meat in your father's house? When was the last time you ate meat? Huh? You know what? Finish this food. I don't want to see this food in the dustbin. I'm sure you finish it. I'm clear of this mess. If you don't finish this food, you'll regret ever coming to this house. Clean this mess up now. I see if your generation can afford meat. It's not the end of the month yet. I know. That is not your salary. That's just my little way of saying thank you for coming through for me the other day. I'm sorry, sir. I can't accept this. Besides, I was only trying to help. It's thank not necessary. I insist. No, I, hey, 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 hey. Just. Give me that. Give me that. Give me that. Get back to work immediately. You know, showing whom you are is not necessary all the time. So, you don't have money to give to me, but you have money to give to that riffraff. I don't have a word for you. You're just so unbelievable. Big! 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 I have told you to stop calling me. Just stop. I have moved on. But I still love you. Do you? Because it looks to me like she dumped you. You know that's not true. So, why this constant call? I missed you, my woman. You can say that to those teenage girls that you lie to. Just give me a chance to take care of you and let me show you. I don't need you to take care of me. I don't. I have a boyfriend. Please stop calling me. Just stop. I know you still love me. You disgust me. Prove it. Come say it to my face. What are you looking at? Um, 
Sorry, ma. I was just waiting for you to finish your call to inform you that the food is ready. Did you hear anything? No. Not even a word. Okay. Go back. Can I... I'll stop sneaking around, please. Can I serve it? Go, go, go. I can't believe she did that. <laughs> I have a strong conviction that she's having an affair. Huh. But you don't have proof. So please, mind your business. It's just sad because my boss is a good man. He doesn't deserve that. No one does. <laughs> good man indeed. Honestly, that money he gave me would have gone a long way if that witch hadn't snatched it from me. <laughs> Sonia. Because your boss gave you money does not make him a good man. So, what makes him a good man? I'm saying he has never treated me badly before. But has he ever defended you? So, he's an accomplice as well. Well, they are all adults, so they are responsible for their own actions. I agree. But that still doesn't make him a good man. He is a good man. He has a good heart. You just have to be around him to know. Hey. <laughs> Sonia, I can't believe you are defending him. I'm not defending him. I'm just saying he's a good man, that's all. I hope he's not what I'm thinking. I'm not supposed to know what you're thinking. Hey. Huh. Okay. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> huh. I guess I'm wasting my time on this game. Dan, you need to give him more time for things to naturally unfold. More time? How long? Can't you see it's crumbling my life? There's nothing wrong with your life, okay? Your business is flourishing and your household is doing okay. And yes, you're still here. Doing what exactly? Taking care of you? Dan, I know, I understand. I can see that I'm not blind. I know you truly love this girl. But trust me, I can't sit back and watch you ruin your own life. I think it's time I quit. Yeah. I'm sorry, bro. It's too late. It's too late for that. You just have to remain like this until we get what we want. What you want, you mean? Huh? What if you don't get it? Trust me, I will. Because she is just too much of a whore. And making you blind to that fact is one hell of a professional witchcraft. Speak carefully, Val. Dan, please. You need to wake up to see what is happening around you. Okay? You need to wake up. Because I need a microscope, man. Let's talk about business, please. You know, we have an important business meeting next week. Oh, thank God. Don't even go there. Are you traveling? I'm leaving. You're leaving? So when are you coming back? Coming back to where? Home. Home? <laughs> this is your home. I mean, I'm a visitor here. And, you know, visitors leave at some point, right? But this is also your home. No, it's not. <laughs> you know what, yeah? To be honest, I am sick and tired of everything that is going on. This is not how I planned my life to be. Please. You, you know I love you, right? I, lo I love you too. I know, I know you, you do. 
But I can't marry you. I mean, look at you. Quite pitiful. And I don't wish to marry out of pity. I want to marry because I love. And, and at this point, I can't, I can't even differentiate both. Please, please don't leave me, please. I'm not leaving you yet. I just want to take a break and, you know, clear my head. Okay, so, so when are you coming back? Well, coming back? Yeah. Um, darling, I don't know. Maybe a year? Two? Or never? Look, I, I, please, please. I just want to, you know, go and look out for myself, take care of myself and, you know, know what's please, happening. Please, please don't leave me. Please don't leave me. Look, 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 at, look at my condition, please. But I don't need you. Don't you get it? There's no sex, no money. You don't even respect me. So, so what am I, I doing I, I, here? I, okay, fine. I can make amends. I, I, I can, please. I know you'll make amends, darling. But I'm done. Please. Okay? Please don't leave I'm me. Done. Please, I beg you, please. Take care of you. You'll be fine. Please, are you going to leave me like this? Please. Sorry. Please. Sir, should I serve your meal now? Don't want to eat. But you haven't eaten anything since morning. I'm not hungry. But you need to eat so you can take your. I drugs. said I'm not hungry. But the doctors, the doctor said. Get out. Get out! Yeah, it was a very tough negotiation, you know. But of course, you know me, I nailed it. Oh, that's nice. But he wants to see you. Sir, you came. Thank yeah, you, sir. how are you, Sonia? I'm fine, thank you, sir. Sir, how are you feeling? That is none of your business. Get out of here and get my friend a drink. Fast. No, it's okay, it's okay, it's okay.
that about? Alvin. Doesn't look like nothing to me. Look, fine. I was drunk. I'm not sure what happened afterwards. So I don't know what she's thinking in her head. So I need to put it straight to her. She's thinking, smiling sheepishly. <laughs> wait, wait, wait. You, you did what? What's funny? Why are you laughing? Bro, this is funny. I mean, and I guess she likes you. I guess it's time for you to leave. Listen, this girl is a good girl. Okay? At least better than that. What's her name again? She's a local girl. She's not my class. Ah, you didn't know all of that when you were drunk, right? Listen, bro, this girl is a nice person. She has a good heart and beautiful too. Tell me, is there anything a man would want in a woman she doesn't have? The last time I checked, you're still single. And so what? Listen, bro, I, I want you to understand. I don't want to hear anything you want to say. What are you saying before again? The contract guy, you fixed the dates. I'm listening. He fixed the date. I want the date again. What is this? It's food, sir. I'm not blind. What I'm asking is, why so much veggies? You don't like them much in my food. It's nutrients. You need it, sir. And I have a lot of bills to pay. What does uh, that got to do with my food? Well, I need you to stay alive. And to stay alive, the doctor said you have to eat healthy. And if you eat healthy, you get to leave. When you leave, I get to keep my job. I keep my job, I get to pay my bills. I didn't mean for you to tell me your life story. Enjoy your meal, sir. If you need anything. You've been the kitchen here, famous line, I know. Thank you. What's this? I actually thought that. That what? That he loves you. What were you thinking? I was hoping that he was different and that he maybe he had a heart. Hey. I think you need to leave that place before he messes for that with your head. I can't leave him. He's alone. He needs help. He needs help indeed. You are just looking for a reason to continue staying in that house. No, that's not true. I'm saying he's alone. He can't even make his meals or... Do his laundry. I see you are not thinking straight. You can't keep caring for somebody who doesn't even appreciate you. I, th I think I've fallen in love with him. I really don't know what to do. <laughs> you have fallen in love with him. How can you fall in love with somebody that does not even love you, that can never ever love you? So now he doesn't even see you as somebody he can love. Don't you see it? Well, he needs me. I can't leave him. He's lonely. Sonia, he will be fine. Okay? He's going to be fine. Stop crying. Huh? Clean your eyes now, eh? Every time I'll be telling you to stop crying. I don't like this. Baby, I'm sorry I walked away. What do you want? 
Are you here to remind me of how pitiful I look? Baby, please. I am so sorry. That was the main thing to say to you. I shouldn't have said that. Please. I didn't mean it that way, babe. You sure did. Babe, I know that I hurt you so much. And I feel horrible. You know, I wish you could be honest for once. I wish. Baby, I am honest. Babe, I... I just realized how much I missed you. Babe. What do you really want? Huh? What? Because the last time I checked, you only care about yourself and no one else. Baby, that's not true. I care so much about you. I, I just realized how much I, I missed you and how much I cared about you and... Let us enough to that. Please. I'm sorry that I ever did that to you, babe. Just that I was confused. But I just realized my mistake and how much you mean to me, babe. Babe, please, I cannot live without you. You mean the world and more to me, babe, please. I promise I'm not going anywhere again. Please forgive me. You know you hurt me, right? Babe, I know. I'm sorry. I would never do it again. I promise. It cost my heart, babe. That onion properly. It does not look good at all. I believe I'm talking to someone. I believe so too. Did you just say something? No, I did it. Have you greeted me today? I don't owe you anything, madam. What did you just say? It is not part of my contract to greet everyone in this house. Wow. Oh. And I hope this is included in the contract. Idiot. You better know your place in this house. Animal. Yes, so was it come in? What do you want? A delivery came for you, sir. From whom? I didn't say. It's anonymous. 
the dispatch rather just mentioned your name and the address of the house. Let me have it. Video? Diva! You went too far, Sonia. No, I didn't. She doesn't love him. She's only after his money. That is not your business. Your job in that house is to take care of the affairs of the house, not to meddle in their personal affairs. Why are you sounding like I did something wrong? Yes, you did. You broke somebody's relationship. I did not. She did that herself when she went back to sleeping with her ex and having the guts to record as shameless self having sex. Look, Sonia, you are my friend. And if you do something wrong, I will not hesitate to tell you. Well, she's a terrible person. Are you better than her? I didn't do anything wrong. No, you didn't. But the motive is where the problem is. Sonia, I hope you're not doing all this because... Because of what? What are you trying to say? Get away from me. Oh, sir, you need to eat. I'm not hungry. You haven't eaten anything. I can't stay here and watch you starve to death. Get out. Please. I said, get out! What's going on here? He has refused to eat. <sighs> okay, I'll take the food away. Daniel, for how long do you intend to continue doing this? I said that I'm not hungry. 
Why is it so difficult for all of you to understand? She is the only one with you in this house. So you better treat her nicely. I don't need anyone. I don't need her. I just want to be left alone. Daniel, for how long? For how long do you intend to continue to mourn someone that doesn't care about you? Someone that has no iota of feeling for you? For how long? Bro, you need to wake up from this illusion and face reality. Alright? Jonathan, let me be. I can't. I cannot let you wallow in self-pity. I won't. Alright? Bro, you got, you got to treat that girl nicely. She, she cares about you. I have made your bed and your bathing water is ready. You've never been in love. That's why you talk nonsense. Sir, you need to come and have your bath so you can rest. I don't want you to tell me what to do. Hmm? Um. That's enough. You've had enough. Stop it, please. Stop. For your sake. I don't want you to tell me what to do. Get out of this place. I'm sorry. I'm You're sorry? If you want to go, you can freaking go! Yes! No. That's all you do! Leave! Fucking leave if you want to leave. Get out! Leave. If you want to leave, leave. Before you do this. Bro, I, you know, I'm really, I'm really glad you're, you're gradually bouncing back. I can't believe all this happened in a short time. I told you, boy, you, you chose to trust her. Can't believe I was going to get married to her. <laughs> On the flip side, when I think about this, I'm kind of happy it happened. You know, I'm glad your heart got shattered to reset your brain. <laughs> okay, don't go too far. Yeah, um, you know, the truth is that it's a good thing that she's out of your life. But what you need to do now is to forget everything about her, you know, flush her from your system and move on. See the people around you. So easy to say. Oh, easy. <sighs> oh, God. How is it getting along? I don't even know. I just feel like a mess right now. <sighs> Take it easy on yourself. Whatever happened is on them, not you. I feel like it's my fault. I should have left things the way they are, but no. It's all my fault. But I warned you. I warned you. You just never listen to me. Please, please, Vivian, please don't make things more horrible, okay? You need to take it easy on yourself, okay? You didn't ask her to cheat. And you didn't also ask her to be the horrible person that she is. Although you should have listened to me. Please, can you pick his hand already? <laughs> At least I got you to shut up. Huh? Your problem is that you never listen to me. You know, all you do is you go out there, you do what you're not supposed to do, and then when you mess up, 
you come back here crying like a baby. Look, you have to leave that house and run away from their problems. I can't leave. He's not strong yet. He's still very weak and you need someone. Good morning, sir. Good morning. I hope you slept well. What rubbish is this? How could you serve me this for breakfast? But you love this meal, sir. And who give you the right to tell me what I like? Take this rubbish off my face! Jesus, what a surprise, mom! <laughs> what are you doing? <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> How are you? I never mentioned you're returning anytime soon. I had to, I had to. Jesus I Christ. I had to look you. at you. Mom, I miss you so much. I Come here. <laughs> good to have you back. I miss you so much. I miss you too. You're yeah. not looking good. Oh, mom, please don't start. You You've not been feeding well. Why? Let me just go here, please don't start. You're looking so tiny, so tiny, oh, so poor to be old. Oh Lord, have mercy. Sonia! <sighs> Sonia! Wow. Come here quickly! Welcome, ma. How was the trip, ma? Keep that to yourself. So you've not been taking care of my son? You've not been feeding him well? Why is he looking so skinny? Ma, he has refused to eat what I cook. He has refused to eat what you cook? Now go inside and get him something to eat before I lose it. Okay. Stupid girl. Come back here! Get this luggage and take it in. And be fast about it. No sense. Mom, that wasn't really necessary. You just go here. You're already nagging. Me, you call the snagging? That's what you're doing, Mom. Call the snagging That's when you're not looking good. Mom, you're looking don't too poor to be old. Oh my you God. Just, you just go here and you're already shouting. My dear. The truth is, if she is not ready to do this job, she should just pack her things and leave. I hate having irresponsible people around me. You know her. that. No, she's trying her best, okay? Please, just take it easy with her, okay? Please. Good to have you back. Hey, come sit. I'm so glad that my man is back on his feet mentally. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. So tell me, how has business been going on? Fine, fine. Uh, I sent a draft of the proposal to your email. Oh, thank you. Hey, I just want to say thank you for being so amazing. Thank you for being there for me. I appreciate it. Nothing is too much for a brother. Mm -hmm. I'm just happy that you're, you're coming back. Yeah. You know, I can't keep wallowing in pain. Plus, I, I'm so glad I'll be out of this ridiculous chair. <laughs> <laughs> when I'm beginning to think that you're enjoying it. Are you kidding me right now? <laughs> enjoying what? <laughs> Come on, don't start. My mm. mom is around and she might show up, so. Besides, my mom is back. So she might show up anytime. No, she wouldn't. I don't think so. Besides, why would you even care? I don't even know. <laughs> you see, um, Daniel, I, I have this conviction. I have this strong feeling that your housemate is in love with you. Stop playing. What sort of useless joke is that? My house help is what? Is she sick? She doesn't know her class or what? I think she's mad. Bro, listen, love has nothing to do with class. I mean, your experience with Diva should have taught you that. With all the class she claimed, she still messed up. Till this moment, we do not know her true identity. Whatever happened, as in the past, was Sonia? God, she's totally out of the picture. A dropout. Please, listen, you need to know who I am and where I stand and where she belong. Please, we're not in the same class. Daniel, Thank you. Daniel, Daniel, what's can? Love, not education. Love. Yeah, education is important. Love. I know. I mean, you need a woman that will give you peace of mind. You need to... A... <sighs> Can you stop talking, please? And let's talk about the business. Thank you. Mm 
Na drop there. Has my son be fed, Sonia? No, ma. Why? What? Why? <laughs> what did I tell you? Why did I tell you? But he said he doesn't want to eat. <laughs> Are you talking back at me? No. Are you talking back at me? Take his food to him now immediately. Okay. <laughs> What do you mean you're leaving? Oh, I don't want to work for you anymore. Do you have your resignation letter? It's on the dining table. Have a good day. Daniel! 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 Mom. You're standing. Yes. I was never crippled. Daniel, stop being stubborn. You need to be more careful with our health. But I do take care of myself. What are you talking about, Sam? Stop being stubborn. You need to be more careful with your health. All right, Sam. Noted. Then I hope you know the gravity of what you are dealing with. I said I'm fine, Sam. <laughs> and yet we are here. Stubbornness will lead us anywhere. Sam. I said I am fine. Don't worry yourself, okay? In that case, I will show your drops to your fiance so that she will ensure that you take them. Show them to my maid instead. Okay. As you wish, no problem. All right. I'm sorry. What? Do me a favor. What's that? Tell everyone I can't walk again, including my mom. Everybody. I didn't just want you to sign it like a bird to diva. Regarding how close both of you were and how much you trusted her. You wouldn't have accepted her the plan, so I shot you out. Sorry about that, Mom. My God. Oh, my goodness. Oh, my goodness. I'm so happy. But please, don't you ever play this kind of tricks on me again. Please. Don't tell, Mom. Wow. We're going to throw a party. A dinner party for two tonight. Sonia! It's not in. You sent her out? No. She says she's done working with us. Why? I am not interested in anything you have to say. How have you been? Fine, as you can see. Sonia, I, I'm here to talk. Listen, I am done with everything that has to do with your friend and his household. Okay? Except if you have anything else to say. Sonia, I... 
I know that you really loved my friend. Okay, but the question is, do you still love him? It doesn't matter. After all, I'm just a maid. Sonia, the truth is that he never knew you loved him. I don't want him to know. Well, I, I saw how intentional you were about my friend. Nobody has ever been there for him like that. Well, I still don't care. Sonia, you have a chance. You have an opportunity to show him that you still love him. You can't just quit. I mean, you go for what you want. I don't want to. Last I checked, he's not into school dropouts. I'm not his class, and I'm too local for him, right? Sonia, you just need to forget all of that, okay? Just forget it is in the past. All right? is so empty. <laughs> Sonia does the shopping. What uh, even water? God, I'm so hungry. You can make something for yourself or better still eat outside. And they bring back home won't be a bad idea. Um, that's not what I want. I want homemade food. <sighs> I'm still going. House address? Whose? Sonia's. You can go look for her or stay here and let pride kill you. Look, Jonathan, I told you that you I what? don't... Don't like her? Listen, Daniel, I know you. I know when you're clearly in love, even if you refuse to admit it. Look, I understand what you're trying to do. But I promise I won't fall for it. Daniel, you need to stop wallowing in regret and go get her. Thanks. Thanks for your advice. I appreciate it. But I think I have to let her go. Come on, you haven't even tried. Okay, Jonathan, what is wrong with you? Why are you trying to hook me up with this girl? She might not even like me the way you're exaggerating. Okay, okay. Um, actually, I'm here because uh, Mr. Damian says he wants to see you in person before he can sign the contract. Mr. Damian? Yeah. Why? What for? When you get there, you can ask him. God, it's always difficult to do business with this man. Yet our biggest client. <clears throat> realized and also since when since Diva left son 
I think you need to visit a therapist. Yes, you've ever made a mess of your head. That I can understand. But this Sonia... <laughs> it's just an aftermath. No, it's not wrong. I know what I'm feeling. Son, you just have to think straight. Take a break! Go on vacation! Go somewhere! I don't need all that, Mom. I don't. For the first time in my entire life, someone showed me how to properly love and how to be loved. Even when I took her for granted several times, she persisted. Daniel, stop this! Stop it! How can you stoop so low to... I mean, don't you, that girl is a nobody! And she doesn't have a place in her home! You know it! And I found her happiness in her. All you found is madness. Do you even honor this family standard? Do you? Mom, you have never been on my side. All you care about is business, standards and class. I am your only child, Mom. The only child. Do you even care about my happiness? Do you? Son, this is so unfair of you to say this. You know I've ever cared for you. I care for you and I care about everything that makes you happy. But how do you expect me to take, take it that you want to take a maid? Oh no. I, I don't even know how to digest it. Oh no. Take it, process it, and digest it. I'm telling you because I can't help it. After everything I went through in the hands of that man and his household, he thinks he can just show up. Well, you need to give him an opportunity to talk. And say what? He thinks he can just say sorry and everything will be fine, right? Sonia, you need to hear him out. Whatever he has to say, I do not want to hear it. Well, I think he's a changed person. <laughs> changed or not, I don't care. I just want him out for good. I still feel you should have a rethink. God forbid. God forbid I ever think about all the things I went through in that house. Listen, everything that has to do with Daniel is in the past now. And I want it to remain that way. You need to forgive him. So that you can have your own peace. Please, please, can we just change the topic? Fine. This one, you hear me out. What do you want from me? I have left your house and you won't stop following Someone me around. Hear me out. I'm sorry. I'm I've sorry heard you. Look, I know I was mean and cruel. Please forgive me. You and your family were so mean to me. Yeah, I know. I'm sorry. Please, I beg you, forgive me. Look, I'm sorry, okay? I know when I was supposed to stand and defend you, I kept quiet. Please, just tell me you forgive me. Please, I beg you. I'm forgiving you from my heart, I have. Thank you. So, when are you coming to the house? Honestly, since you left, everything hasn't been the same. The house is dirty, unkempt, untidy, no food in the house. I've not eaten for a long time. Please, I miss everything about your food and Please. And me being a maid, of course. Is this why you're here? To tell me that your house is dirty? No. I, I should return to your house as what? As a maid. I'm never going to do that. Stay away from me. It's so difficult for me, Sonia. But I said I have forgiven you. What else do you want from you? Me? I need you 
need you. Well, I don't want to be anyone's maid again. Not as my maid. I need the woman that knows how to take care of me. The woman that makes me happy. The one place I find peace. So that's you. I need you. Look, I don't know how to explain it, but my life is wrapped around you. Please don't say no to me, I beg you, please. I need you. 